What is up everybody, it's your boy Duty back again with another video and this time your boy Duty is taking a look at um, or analyzing DSP's next venture into begging and uh, today is Friday so that means Call of Duty, uh, Call of Duty 6 is coming out and uh, Phil's going to try to monetize his viewers and extract as much money as he can out of those Velcro wallets and uh call of duty is you know it's it's it, it always works out pretty good for phil uh for a few streams and then of course it dies out the hype dies down and no one cares now one of the little schemes that our boy phil tries has tried to do in the past has been um uh essentially gambling he called it bounties then he called it challenges and uh, he had to modify it every so often because he was concerned about YouTube's terms of service. After, of course, many individuals like myself brought up the fact that, hey, you have to be careful. That might be against YouTube's terms of policy, you know, terms of service. And uh, I think he finally realized that, OK, maybe the detractors and duty aren't lying. He researched it and came to the realization that, yeah, I, I can't I can't be doing or can't be doing gambling streams or whatever. Uh, wager streams on YouTube so he chilled with that last year like towards the middle of the um, the streams like I think by the third or fourth one after the gimmick wore off he, he stopped talking about bounties and uh, uh, challenges and so on if someone brought it up he would even he would he would casually acknowledge it but not really focus on it because he was concerned that someone would report him again this video isn't to report I'm not it's not a call of action to report Phil leave phil alone if he wants to go ahead and stream and do gambling streams or wager streams on kick or youtube he'd knock himself out i, I personally don't care i just want to highlight this because uh it just shows again that phil <laughs> refuses to do any research whatsoever on this on his own uh the only thing he's worried about and concerned about is making money uh everything else can go to hell it literally can and you would think he would dig in and research i mean it took me literally five minutes to see a twitter post that someone posted on twitter about the term to service and i went and i started looking at it and, and researching myself and i think phil is going to run into some problems here now what he's planning to do is he's planning to stream on twitch and kick uh excuse me on youtube and kick that's what he's going to do and i'm guessing that if you want to do a wager you have to do it through kick and in Phil's eye, that's okay. No, Phil, if you're streaming, if you're dual streaming Call of Duty on YouTube and Kick, YouTube's terms of service still apply, buddy. I'm sorry. So you can't really talk about rewards or challenges or whatever. I'm not sure how you're going to do it. If you wanted to do the challenges or whatever, then I would recommend you potentially just do it straight up at Kick and not stream it on YouTube just to kind of buy yourself uh, some cushion there. But anyway, I'm going a little ahead of myself. Let's hear Phil talk about it. I mean, look at his hands. He's just like, oh my God, money, money, money. Let, let's let's hear Phil talk about the scheme. And then we'll, t we'll take a look at some information that uh, I found on the uh, Kix uh, uh, platform. You ready for this? This Friday, we start Call of Duty wagers on Kick. You know, the site that's supposed to be for like wagering. So what do I mean by that? Let's say, for example, people start making challenges for when I play Call of Duty starting this Friday. For example, Phil, go knife only this match and get 15 kills and I will gift you a certain amount of subs to your community. Right? This is the kind of stuff that we were doing on, on YouTube and my haters were like, eh, you're gonna... You're, you're being an asshole and you can't do that. Well, guess what? On kick, no one gives two shits. On kick, that's, you know, the kind of content that people like, right? The stakes, they want stakes. They want wagers. They want something like that to happen. So I'd be okay with that. Listen, I like challenges. We were doing that years ago with the, with the Call of Duty games and it was very fun. It was. So uh, let me translate that it was very lucrative that's what phil wants to say whenever you hear the word fun come out of phil's mouth you can replace that word with lucrative he he made some money it was a good scheme for while it lasted now um phil don't say your haters brought it up to you because anytime your detractors mention something you ignore it because you think they're lying i'm pretty sure someone in your chat brought it up and said hey by the way what they're saying is correct you could get in trouble for it 
And you know that the people that dislike you are going to report you, Phil. It's just obvious that that's what's going to happen. Again, this isn't a call to action. I'm not telling anyone to report Phil. I'm not going to report him. Uh, but again, you know, don't, don't be an idiot, Phil. Listen to this video. Listen to what I'm saying. Uh, again, I don't fully. Okay, so I have to be transparent. I don't fully know for sure whether it's completely 100% against what you're actually doing on kick. I know it's frowned upon on YouTube. I can I can vouch for that. So, Phil, if you're watching this video, take this, you know, as just me giving you information, okay? Now, what I want to do is I want to pull up the Kicks Term to Service. By the way, your boy Duty is streaming on Kick, dual streaming. I have 15, 1,510 followers. Big up. Much appreciated, everybody, for following your boy Duty. Uh, yeah, it, it's much appreciated. So, anyway, I took a look at the community guidelines. And uh, because someone sent me a screenshot with just a snippet about the gambling piece. And big ups to 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 kick for having a pretty small terms of service guidelines. It's pretty short. It's small, which is great. It, it makes it pretty uh, pretty easy to follow. The problem is, of course, ambiguity. People are gonna misinterpret things. Uh, that's probably why YouTube's terms of service is probably like a thousand pages long. But anyway, let's go to the segment where it talks about gambling. Alrighty, here. Let's see here. Do, 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 do. Gambling. Here it is. Guideline fourteen. Now, here's what it says about gambling. Excuse me. <clears throat> Gambling. We encourage all users to be aware and adhere to legal requirements regarding gambling activities in their respective regions to ensure compliance with local laws. Okay, so the first thing is that if you're going to be doing any type of gambling, you need to know whether gambling is allowed in your jurisdiction. So if you live, say, in Utah, where I believe gambling is not legal, I think it's not legal there you probably won't be able to kind of stream gambling streams or whatever. You can get yourself in trouble. So you're kind of going against uh, those, which, you know, those laws. But I think, again, Kick is being very ambiguous here and just saying, hey, if you get in trouble for this by local official, it's not on us. That, that's what you're saying here. Okay. Whether you are permitted to stream gambling games online, uh, e.g. online poker, online back blackjack, depends on the laws regulations of the country in which you're located again uh you phil always brags about how many viewers he has in europe or whatever um or in canada you, you gotta factor in those those rules phil uh which of course you won't because you figure i'm in the united states I, the united states laws just apply to me whatever what might happen is that if you're streaming in youtube um and for some reason it picks it up the algorithm it picks it up that you're kind of doing gambling it may flag the video in a in a certain region but who knows i don't, I don't think youtube's algorithm is, is is that sophisticated so anyway like it has to visually show you like doing slot machines or whatever all right now let's keep going so streaming of gambling on kick with other users tender is strictly prohibited now that's the thing i wanted to focus on here streaming of gambling on kick with other users tender is strictly prohi prohibited this includes any form of buy-in via sweepstakes, a lottery, sub-only competitions, weighted giveaways are not permitted. Minors must not be in connection with gambling, whether it be through participation or any other involvement. Um, so that Shut could mean, up. you know, if, either, if, either, if a minor... Subscribe, donate, or get the fuck out. If a minor and Phil stream, you know, and that would be under 21... And let's say they're even 18 or whatever. They decide they want to give Phil a bounty a wager. Uh, that's a no-no, Phil. That's a no-no. So again, these these terms of service are kind of ambiguous a little bit. But the one thing that really sticks out for me, Phil, here is gambling uh, with other users tender. And I would argue that what you're doing fits this. Like you're actually... So it's not like you're using your own money to do a Hogan pool. You know, what you're doing is you're telling other people, hey, I'm going to allow gambling on my stream, but I'm using your money. You're not loot. You're not putting anything up yourself, Phil. What you're doing is saying, OK, guys, offer me a wager. Right. And if I complete the wager, you're going to give me X amount. You're going to give me subs or whatever. I think again, I think I don't know. I don't fully know, but someone can argue either way. I can argue that this little blurb here 
about using other other people's tender to gamble is strictly prohibited. That might fall under that fill. So again, I, I'm just saying this because you, you're, you're not thinking this fully through. You're just going to stream and do whatever the hell you want and hope that Kick doesn't give a shit, right? That's what you're hoping for. And that you're able to stream and there's no problem. That might be the case. Cake might not give a fuck. I mean, a thousand people could probably report you, which I'm not calling anyone to do. Don't report Phil. But let's say that happens. Cake may not do shit and don't care. But are you going to risk that? Like, are you going to risk getting your Cake channel taken down? Because I'm telling you right now, if you get taken down and they remove you and they ban you or they demonetize you, whatever, those 700 subs or... 800 subs or whatever you're supposed to be getting in your next uh, kick check that's gone they reimburse that back to the uh to the person and that's gone you ain't getting that check so again um you're going to have to be careful and the other thing here is minors must not be must not be in connection with gambling whether it be through participation or any other involvement phil we know that we, you have minors in your chat we know i can i can name at least three people that i know that are under 21 years old that watch your stream so again this is very ambiguous but when it says must not be in connection with gambling whether it be through participation or any other involvement watching a stream could constitute involvement phil it could so again phil i would recommend you research this you dig into this you ask around before you decide to stream on youtube and kick call of duty and do wagers or whatever because you know you you run you're running afoul with YouTube's terms of service by doing this, and my understanding is you're going to be multi-streaming on dual platforms, both YouTube and Kick. But you you might be in, uh, you might be in some you know, you might not be in compliance with Kick's terms of service right here as well, for for two factors: the using other people's money, <laughs> which is what you're doing, and uh, minors. So. Anyway, just wanted to put that out there, Phil. Uh, again, no one is calling. A duty is not calling anyone to report Phil. To be honest, it doesn't really do anything, to be honest. I just want to put the information out there and let Phil know, hey, you got to be careful. You may want to research this because, you know, you might get sent to ban world. Anyway, hope you guys enjoy, your vid enjoy the video. Peace out.